She's sleeping. Uh, at least I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. How's she feeling? Use your imagination. That place sucked every last drop of humanity from her. It's not enough. She already gave up everything she had. I just kept taking more and more. She's in some kind of trance, like she's folded into herself. No reaction to her surroundings whatsoever. I really, really didn't want to poke around in her head. I did it for you. I just want you to know that. I need to talk to her. Listen, I know you've got some serious questions that she's got the answers to. I mean, if I were you, I'd want to know too. But it's just not gonna happen. She's completely out of it. You've gotta be fucking kidding me. You're mad at her? Why? When you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. Judy, I didn't have any I know. Other... It's okay. So I don't get why... You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. How many BDs did you manage to rip? Two. Only one of them's intact. Understandable, though. The rest... Well, they're in the same shape as Evelyn right now. Guessing you saw them already. Yeah. Had to wrestle to make sense of the whole thing. But I don't want to say anything and taint your perspective. You should go in with fresh eyes. Okay. Show me. Give me a sec while I set the parameters. Guess we'll find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. I'll be the first to admit, this does not look good. Listen, Evelyn. I really need your help. It's important. If I don't do anything, and do it soon, I'll die. I know it's a bad time, but I gotta ask. You got any idea how to remove the biochip? Or know anyone else who might? Hey. How you feeling? You need anything? I'm not here to nag. Just talk. You're right. This is a complete waste of time. Well, now, look at you. All right, roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape. Not all that editable. Huh. Glad you managed to salvage them in the first place. Needs a second to load. Quality's lousy. But I did what I could. What am I looking out for? Every single piece of tech I see? Security? We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. Take a look around if you want. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. Can't see your face. <sighs> Under normal circumstances, that kind of encryption's easy to crack. But not this time. Whoever she is, she's got serious net running skills. That or someone's working it for her. Hmm. I think I recognize these. What are they? Vive markings. You familiar with them? Not enough to know what they actually mean. Heard of who might use them, though. Who? Could be the Voodoo Boys, but that's just a hunch. Can't be 100% sure. The spine chilling Netrunner crew? Hard to find, because they don't want to be. I wouldn't know where to start. What am I looking at? 
every single piece we, of tech I see. So what about his messages? O Only if you can do it and be parfait. It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual relaxed self. And if he starts talking about the biochip himself? Might not be important. Maybe. But all of them are from Pacifica. Now's down our search at least. What now? Looks like I'm going on a field trip to Pacifica. And if he starts talking about the biochip bio himself? Were you here? Should I Alright, think we got everything. Now we know what happened in Clouds. They're the ones who tried to flatline her. Launched a nuke at her ship. So it was punishment? For getting played by her? She knew more than they thought she knew. Couldn't let that go. So that's who she was running from. The woman who hired Evelyn. Any idea who we're up against? Your guess is as good as mine. Sorry, V. Looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. You're telling me? If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into? Ugh, I'm so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. It's pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swipe the biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you. And brought this all on herself. On you two. There's one more recording. Wanna see it? Sure, why not? Nothing can surprise me at this point. Oui, we are We take young risk. What language is she speaking? I don't know. Haitian Creole? It is the voodoo boys. Didn't I? Wait, let me see if I've got an auto translator. Meantime, you try to tune into the phone's frequency. See what the other side's saying. Got it. Give it a second. You. Heard her mention Yorinobu. Probably why Evelyn buried this recording deep. Caught another name. Something like Silverhand? We have to know what they're saying. It could be important. Fine. Just found the auto-translate package. Should get along fine with your system. I'll install it now. Oui, oui. 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 C'est le plus bon moyen de nous gagner pour nous arriver sur le monde. Il faut que nous prenions chance là. Je vais vous dire même j'avais eu que si le monde a mené nous direct sur Alt. Vous avez une bonne idée? Très bien. Si vous décidez de faire ce que vous pensez, continuez à faire le travail. V, get it together. The biochip we stole. It's, uh... It's got Silverhand's engram burned onto it. Engram? Digitized psyche. Personality construct. <whistles> Can you give me a minute? I need to go over some stuff. In my head. Uh, um, of course. Know who they are, who the woman is. Any idea how we find them? Fuck, V. I've been dead the last half century. Sorry if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. These people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that Netrunner. Finding her is our biggest priority. 
If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that Juju wirehead, okay? Wait, you got any idea how to get in touch with the Voodoo Boys? Why? Worried they'll give Evelyn up to him? No. I didn't trust you at first, but... Well, if you wanted to get back at Evelyn, you would have done it already. So why the worried look? I just... I want it all to work out for you. You got a plan? I'll ask around, make a few calls. Let me put it this way. The Voodoo Boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's gotta know a way in. Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. Thanks, Judy. No, V. Thank you. You're a... You're a good person. Evelyn could never see what was under people's skin. If she could have gotten to know you a bit better, then... Who knows? Things might have turned out differently. <laughs>